Hey guys, here I am at it back again, once again with a little video for, which is a quarantine project that, known as the quarantine PC project, which I'm currently trying to fix this old Samsung all-in-one PC that has a problem where it doesn't boot into Windows it just gives you the BSOD when you um, when you when you first turn it on and uh, I tried to do the um, repair your computer functionality off the um, Windows 10 USB that I'm that I have plugged in and that didn't seem to work out either and and I think something's telling me that the hard drive in this computer might be bad so I notice the little hourglass is very solid and the little hard drive indicator light is blinking away but now I'm trying to see what the culprit is to see what I can do to fix this problem so this computer originally came with Windows 8 but it was upgraded to Windows 10 some point of its life but uh it's got an Intel Core i5, but I, and I believe six gigabytes of RAM, so it looked like we got a little something. So let me see if I can go ahead and reformat this drive, and I'll be right back. Let's let y'all know what's let y'all know some of the progress. So let me put this down for a moment, and I'll be right back. All right, so after deleting all the unwanted partitions on the hard drive and formatting it let's see if we can get past the installation process so we can try and get it successfully installed and try and double check the health of the hard drives make sure everything's all good before we go and activate windows so with that being said, what I think it's either the hard drive is bad, going bad, or or either the OEM installation of Windows that was on this computer was corrupted. Because I mean, you couldn't get the access to any uh, any files that was on the hard drive. So let's see if 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 it's hopefully a corrupted install of Windows. So with that being said, I'll be right back. Alright. Got it fully up and running now since I uh made that attempt to do a Windows reinstall and the install came out successful with the existing hard drive that's in this computer, so so far in this project I didn't have to take the computer apart to change out the hard drive because the hard drive's in good health surprisingly turns out that window the installation of windows in this computer was actually corrupted so what I did was I reformatted the hard drive and works a lot better though and it's interesting that this computer has a one terabyte drive even though it's got, it's pretty f snappy for a computer with six gigabytes of RAM, but overall, it's got a Intel Core i5 clocked at 2.9 gigahertz. And surprisingly, I ain't have to worry about going through the Windows activation process, which is pretty neat because of Windows in particular. Most OEM machines somehow support a digital license so got all the basic programs before I um, put this computer away and um, clean it off some more on the surface but, but other than that it's running perfectly fine so and I'll go ahead and wrap up this little quarantine video PC computer repair project 
It took me a couple little hours just to load the programs and install some updates though, so. So, yep. And I'll see you guys on the next video, and thanks for watching.